Notice this prophetic statement made back in 1890. When speaking of what we're going to be seeing here in these last days, it was declared that Satan is working in the atmosphere. He is poisoning the atmosphere. As students of prophecy, we know who the man of sin is, and we know how Satan uses him to get his agenda carried out here on earth. We also know that since we're so close to the end, the enemy of souls no longer tries to hide his demand for worship from the popes and the prelates of Rome anymore. See this stack of shocking videos when you get time that will help you verify this as fact. Many are unaware that Pope John Paul II hired Al Gore for an undisclosed amount of money to head up the so-called global warming agenda decades ago. And we are all now suffering for it around the world. As strange as this seems, the Vatican was so proud of their maniacal confederation toward poisoning the atmosphere that the Pope actually commemorated Rome's long prophesied coalition by actually minting a coin that boasts of their poisoning of all life on earth using what most now call chemtrails. Check out this coin with an actual airplane spraying chemtrails all over the world with John Paul II as the main character on the coin as a bold spectacle of papal pride. Now it was prophesied, and we now see it is obviously fulfilled. But with all that said, check out this newly released report from August 11th of last week confirming the worldwide poisoning of the atmosphere is now a done deal exactly as it was prophesied in 1890. Headline, no rainwater that falls anywhere on earth is safe to drink. The article says, from the Antarctic to the Tibetan Plateau, rainwater across the globe is too polluted for humans to safely drink, a study has shown. Researchers found significant levels of toxic forever chemicals in rainwater collected around the planet. Christian prophecy is that accurate. Thank you for watching. God bless.